Hey you guys and welcome back to Sassy Classy Makeup Looks. Today I'm going to do a review on a HD press powder. And here it is. I received this about three days ago. This is a very nice press powder. It's HD. Now I am not going to say that this is a dupe for Makeup Forever HD powder. I'm going to say it is better than Makeup Forever HD powder. This powder is so fine, so nice, and I'm going to say the name and I may not get it right and I'm sure you guys will correct me, but Ishenko, Ishenko, it took 15 days for me to receive this. It cost $29.50. Um, I don't know if you can see it. It's just completely white. And when you apply it on your face, it just disappears into the face and gives your skin a flawless, flawless look. Okay? Um, this, I just love it. I think that it's really, really great. Um, I think you should go out and at least, well, you can't just go out and buy it. You have to buy it online only. And, uh, and it takes about 15 days or so for you to receive it. This is a very nice, thin, fine powder. It just goes on smoothly. Uh, it lasts. Um, it can be for dry skin. It could be for oily skin. Either way, a person with a dry skin doesn't even have to use a lot of it. Just putting just a little bit on it, the a person with oily skin will love this because if you put this on it will last all day and you will not be oily at all if you wear this um, this I'm just telling you this um, press powder is really really nice and yes it's a little expensive $29.50 and yes it takes a little while to get here um, took 15 man I actually maybe 17 days in order for it to get uh, be shipped here to me um, and you can only do it online um, so you know those are a few of the you know the cons and the pros of the things um, but um, one of the things that I can just for surely tell you that this is a very nice powder it is very thin and it is a HD powder so it comes out very nice in uh, photos and I will add a couple of photos at the end of this to show you how um, it shows up in photos because there's been word out there that uh, HD powder press powders will leave a flashback <clears throat> on photos which where we highlight our face with these powders and concealers some of them when you take a picture you can actually see where you have actually placed the powder on your face. This does not do that. You will see in the photos that will be coming up afterwards. All I can tell you is um, it's worth the $29.50. Um, if you like the Makeup Forever HD press powder, you're going to love this one. I'm loving it. And I have put my uh, Makeup Forever HD to the side because this one just goes on so nice and sheer. I'm going to apply it on my face. The lighting is a little off, but I hope that you guys can see it. Uh, again, I may get this name wrong. You can probably look it up and just maybe see if it's some other reviews out there about it. But it is Ishenko, and I'll just have it here so in case you want to write it down to spell it out maybe you know it correct me put it in the uh, description below in the comments or whatever tell me the correct name or I didn't say it correctly or whatever but <clears throat> what I know that I do have correct that this powder lasts all day it's a pretty translucent powder it does not go off on white it does not come off white and that uh, you're gonna love it if you um, need a nice pressed powder that is very fine um, that really almost give you an airbrush look so I am going to apply this um, to one side of my face and see if you guys can see the difference uh, with me applying it and just 
right now I, have it, I don't have anything on my face but foundation. Um, I have, um, just in case anyone wants to know, I have on nothing but this Wet n Wow uh, lip balm. Okay. And there it is. It's a Raspberry 281C. And then um, all I have on is, I'm using this today, which is my e.l.f. Um, for the eye bright. That is what I have on. And then, of course, if you've seen my other videos, then you know I have on my gel eyebrow liner. Eyebrow. Y'all gonna notice when I say eyebrow, sometimes I just get it all mixed up, but who cares? Y'all know what I'm talking about. <laughs> anyway, okay, let's get to it. Alright, I'm gonna apply it on. I'm trying to see where the. Okay, I'm gonna apply it on this side of my face. And I mean, it is just totally so thin. I'm telling you, it actually feels good when it's going on. And it is, this is like the truth. Now, I know you can still see like one side of my face got a, a little glow and I think that other side just completely came down. Let's see if... But I am so like this. And it only takes just a... Ooh, ooh, uh oh, uh-oh. Now I'm putting too much on. Okay. See? I only tapped it a little bit in there. And you see all that extra star coming out of the, you know? That's how thin it really is. Okay. Now, you should be able to see that this side is matte. And the other side is shiny. That should be real easy to see. But you may not can see the smoothness that it has given my skin over here. You, you probably can't see that. Here it's, it's smooth, but, you know, it's makeup. But this here has just put a smoothness to my face. And it's, it's just nice. So... I would recommend it. I am going to do a makeup look and when I do my next makeup look I will make sure I have better light so you guys can see it. But one thing you definitely can see is that shine that was on both sides is now going to the other side. I, I am going to try and fix the light and maybe just come back with it but if not you will see the difference I will take a picture just like this with the half and half side so that you can see what uh, the difference is in the, a better light that'll come in come in the picture after this but until then I just want to say that uh, I think this powder is a great uh, buy and for all those who really like to put things on a face that really keeps their face not feeling all the time like you got makeup on and keep it matte some don't like the real dewy look and in my case I go back and forth but if you don't like the dewy look this will work perfectly fine for you if you do like the dewy look then this still will give you a flawless look and you would just have to put on some um finishing powder afterwards that would be all you know finishing spray rather just spray some finishing spray on I haven't tried that so maybe that'll work but what I'm saying is when it comes to a powder being so fine and smooth and thin especially the summertime is coming it stays on all day I'm knowing there will be no problems with my makeup 
when the summertime come and I have this product here. Thank you guys for watching. If you have any comments about the uh, Isha Kat, Ishanko, I told you, you guys will correct me, then leave a comment or anything that you have to say about it uh, below. Um, and again, you can only buy it online and it is $29.50 and just don't be anxious to get it because it won't be there for at least 15 days. And if you purchase it, please come back to my channel and give me a comment. Let me know what you thought about it and if you're also going to do a review on it, let me know so that I can tune in. Thank you. And as always, thank you for tuning in to Classy Sassy Makeup Looks. And until next time, peace.